Okay, so here we are back in our song from level one, and we need to add a, a new track down here for the keyboard that we've attached to it. So I'm just gonna go click on the, the plus button, and it's gonna say, which one track do you wanna do? And we're like, well, we wanna do a MIDI keyboard. Okay, and that's what that keyboard is, it's a MIDI. So I'm going to hit create, and now it's put it up here. And I'm kind of in the wrong place, I'm just gonna drag it down to below. I want it at the bottom. Okay, so there I put the track at the bottom. And now I, I want to isolate the track. So I'm going to hit the headphones here and it's going to gray out everything else. I'm not going to hear any of the rest of the song. I'm just going to hear just this this track here. So and it automatically goes with a uh, classic electric piano. So there's there's the piano. Okay, so uh, the keyboard is working. So let me just back things up so I've got some room here. So what you need to do is you need to record those chords, those four records, four chords, and we got to record them in order, one, two, three, four, and we need to do it with the beat. So I'm going to turn these back on. This is the countdown timer, and this is the metronome, so we know our beats. So let me just rewind to the beginning, and I'm going to press record, and I'm going to start with the first chord. Four, two, oh, I messed that one up. Okay, you see on the screen I messed it up. So basically, I'm going to press the chord, two, three, four, chord, two, three, four, and you have the beat. So let me go back. Let's try this again. Here we go. Again, two, C, two, three, four, G, two, three, four, A minor, two, three, four, F, two, three, four. Okay, I think I got that recording done. So it might take you a lot of practices to get that right but you've got to get that recorded. Let me just go ahead and double click on this track to see what happened. It looks like I have some extra keys that were being kind of played here, like my fingers are kind of too big on the keys and I'm playing some extra things. So I'm going to go and probably record this again. So I want you to do the same thing, record it as many times until you feel like you have a good, clean recording of just playing those four chords, okay? So I'm gonna go ahead and delete this and uh, delete the track. Oh, it deleted the entire track. Let me undo that. All right. I just want to just delete this section right here. There we go. Okay. So um, let me just do it. Let me see if I can do it once again while you're watching me here. C, two, three, four, G, two, three, four, A minor, two, three, four, F, two, three, four. Okay. So I think I've got it there. Uh, come back in the next video and we're going to talk about how to clean up that recording okay but this might take you a half hour to get right but you're going to do that one two and you're going to do it for four beats three uh, sorry two for four beats three for four beats four for four beats until you have it this is what it should sound like let me rewind press play so definitely so there's some things that are offbeat but i'm going to show you in the next video how to fix that all up